I absolutely despise the doctor's office. Well, honey, you only need to come here when you need to. It's just a checkup today, so it should be quick. Do you have any plans after this? I'm supposed to get ice cream with Lawrence and Abby after this appointment. Well, that sounds fun. I wish I could have some ice cream. Dana Smith, the doctor is waiting for you. Oh, that's us, Dana. Mom, if it's okay, I'd like to go in by myself. Oh, yeah, that's fine, honey. I'll wait here. Uh, hello there. Hi, you must be Dana. I'm Dr. Optimal. Can you please come over here so I can check your heart rate and your weight and your height? Yeah, sure. Heartbeat sounds good. Can you please step on the scale for me? Yeah, sure. All right, thank you, Dana. You may get off it now. Mind you telling me what my weight is? Yes, you are a 60 pound dog, um, a little bit overweight for your breed, but that's okay. Nothing with a good diet and some working out won't fix. Oh, okay. Maybe lay off the dog treats and gummy bears? Yeah. Alright, come over here so I can check your height. Well, I'm overweight. I didn't think this would happen. I mean, yeah, I eat a lot of junk food, but all my friends do and they seem perfectly fine. Huh. Maybe I should do something about this. I'll ask my friends for advice. Yeah, they'll tell me what to do. I've never dealt with this before. Dana, please come over here. Oh, yes, sorry. So then I was like, if you want to take me out on a date, you have to follow me on TikTok. I mean, I get that requirement. Your TikToks are amazing. Hey guys. Hey Dana, are you gonna order something? Hey, um, I don't think so. I actually have a question to ask you pets. What's the best way to lose weight? Personally, I don't eat for a few days. That works for me. Oh, my dog, Abby, that is so unhealthy. Dana, why are you trying to lose weight? Well, my doctor said I'm a bit overweight and you know, I want to be healthy, so I guess I'm doing it for my health, but I'm a bit uh, anxious about my body image. I'm worried that I don't look good enough. Good enough? Ugh, please. You're beautiful, just the way you are. And I've never had to really lose weight or worry about it, so I can't really help you, and I'm really sorry about that. Lawrence isn't helping. Go by with what I said. It works every time. Dana, you're perfectly fine. I mean, my mom gained weight when she was pregnant with me. Lawrence, that's because she had a pet growing inside her. What? All I'm saying that it's natural. Weight fluctuates over time. Besides, you don't have anybody to impress, right, Dana? Um, no. Hey, pets, thank you for watching my food. Oh, Dana, hi. Um, now that you're here, I was wondering, tomorrow night, would you like to go to the new pizza place that opened down the street? Oh, Turbo, hey! Oh, my dog. Turbo is totally asking out on a date. You have to take the chance. Um, yeah, sure. Great, well, I have to go. I'm gonna grab a bag to get the food. Oh, my dog. I have a date with Turbo. Ah, hot pet alert. I guess you gotta lose some of that weight now. Abby! <sighs> right. Am I really that overweight? Will Turbo still like me? Dana! Dana! Um, I'm not hungry, Mom! Alright. Well, dinner will be in the fridge. I guess I'll take Abby's advice. Ugh, I'm so hungry. Ugh, I'm really tired. <laughs> I'm coming. 
Dana, I haven't heard from you in over 24 hours. Did you eat dinner last night? I left some in the fridge for you. Are you doing all right? I'm fine, Mom. Oh, oh my dog. What time is it? It's 5 p.m. Why? Oh, my dog. I have to get ready for my date with Turbo. Mom, get out. Out now. Excuse out, me. Out, I'm trying out. to I see get if ready my daughter's now. okay. Leave. Fine. Be safe on your date. And talk to me when you're done when you come back. Oh, my dog, Turbo. I'm so sorry I'm late. That's okay, Dana. I'm just looking at the menu. What are you thinking about getting? I think I just want a regular cheese pizza. But man, that seafood pizza looks delicious. Um, to be honest, I don't really know. I might just get a water. What? A water? I really wanted us to try this pizza together. Um, how about I get a salad instead? They have salads here, right? I mean, yeah, they do. Alright, then I'll get that. He probably thinks I'm so weird. I'm already messing this up. Mm. This pizza is so good. How's your salad? Um, it's great. Very yummy and green. Yeah, um, I've barely seen you touch it, though. You've been very quiet on this date. Do you even like me? Of course I do. I'm just thinking about a lot, that's all. Well, you can talk to me, and we can share the rest of this pizza together. I don't want the pizza. I'm trying to watch my figure. Oh, okay. Um, we could have went somewhere else then, or did something else for the date. It's fine. Uh, um, is that your stomach growling? You should really eat. Don't tell me what to do. Uh, I'm sorry, but you seem hungry and you're not feeding yourself. Don't tell me how to live my life, okay? I barely know you. Look, I'm going to be honest. I overheard your conversation with Abby. You don't need to starve yourself. I don't know what she was thinking telling you that, but that's not good advice at all. Oh, so you eavesdrop on people's conversations? That's great. I don't need your help. Dana, I think you're perfect the way you are. And if you need help losing weight, starving yourself isn't the way to go about it. That's not healthy at all. I actually really enjoy fitness and I can help you out. But please don't hurt yourself. I want to be pretty like Abby. You don't need to be pretty like Abby. You need to be pretty like Dana. Yourself. You are beautiful, Dana, and I like you for who you are. You don't have to eat just salads or starve yourself. You can be you. You can eat whatever you want. Just moderate it. Make sure you get your daily dose of vitamins, your proteins, all that stuff. It'll all be okay. This conversation is starting to sound like a sitcom and I'm tired of it. But I really appreciate everything you're saying to me. How about we get out of here and go get some ice cream? <sighs> Fine. <laughs> Great. I know a vegan ice cream place we can go to. It has much healthier options and you won't feel too bad about eating it. It'll all be alright.